Hi computer arts students, it's Miss Taylor. We're going to move down to the globe and what we're going to learn here is how to move layers, transform with aspect ratio, that's just keeping your proportions, curve and slant an object, use the text tool, and then link layers. The first thing that you want to do is locate your move tool. Your move tool is right up here. The shortcut for your move is the V key. The best way to get to a layer is simply by just holding down your command key and then clicking on the layer you want to move. The move tool will grab what's directly underneath. I'm going to go ahead and take North America, move Europe out of the way, and position it where I want. Now if I'd like to tilt or slant, I hit Command T, and I just wait for that curved arrow, and then double click. If I'd like to make it bigger, I hit Command T again and hold down Shift. Shift will keep my aspect ratio, meaning that it'll be proportionate to the original um, layer. If I don't hit Shift, this is what will happen. It'll either get too thick or wide. The next thing that I want to do is go to my text tool. My text tool is the large, the capital T in your tools palette. Simply just click once and then type in what you'd like. To change color, you can highlight. Click on this little box here and find a color that works best for you. This color slider will bring you to the color family. So we have your Roy G. Biv colors here and then you can choose different shades and tints of that particular color. You can also bring your cursor outside, you get an eyedropper. Whatever you tap on, it'll change to that color. If you're interested in viewing the different texts available, you can highlight your text here, highlight this in your option bar up here, and then use your arrow keys to scroll through the different font styles and then simply just click on any other button in your tool bar to get off the text layer. If you need to go back, if you've made a spelling error you want to modify, just go back to your T and then click on there and make your modifications. Now we're going to go ahead and link layers in order to bring them into our main um, poster. So I'm going to go ahead and rip this off so I have two separate documents that I can see. And then I'm going to link all the layers that I want to bring over. Now I like to bring over Minnesota, of course, the globe. So in order to highlight the globe, I'm going to hold down Command. And then I also want to keep holding down Command and click on North America. And there it is. Those are the ones that I want to move. Now to keep them linked together when I bring them over into my new document, I'm going to right click on all three of those layers and then go to the link layers. And you'll see a little chain link that attaches itself to each layer. And then at this point I can go ahead and move it. I'm holding my mouse clicker down and then releasing. It's a little too big so let's hit Command T, hold down Shift at the corner, and just bring it down in size a little. That should do it. That's your lesson on the globe, and we'll see you next time. Bye.